Credit has never really made sense to me. I mean, I know it's popular. It's a, it's a really big thing here. People love it. But did you know in some cases in life, you can be penalized for not having credit? Like, people treat you differently. They treat you with this weird suspicion. Now, son. Sorry. Daughter. Daughter. I couldn't have a son. Son. Daughter. I need you to listen up. In life, you have to earn money to buy things. You have to get a job, go to work, use the money from the work to buy the things that you want and need. Understood? Work money stuff. In that order. Don't forget. Alrighty. Well, hello there. Hi, I'd like to apply to live here. Alrighty, why don't you just fill out this application and we're going to need a copy of your credit score and your credit report, please. Oh, I don't have a credit score. You do? Oh, yes you do. Yes you do, honey. You can get it for free online at... No, I mean I don't have credit. I buy things with money I've earned. Oh, maybe you don't realize. Even things like car loans are credit. They count as credit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I paid for my car with money. You... I'm sorry, can you hold on a minute? Hey boss, we have a potential Lisi out there says she ain't got no credit, pays for everything in cash up front. Mm -hmm. Even her car? Mm -hmm, even her car. Drug dealer. We don't fiddle with that type around here. Now are you sure? I wouldn't say that. She's got a nice head now. You listen and you listen good. I've been in the business for over 25 years. The girl is trouble. What's she got to hide, huh? Mm? No, no, you're probably right. You're probably right. She's probably a drug dealer wants to cover her tracks. No money trails. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Don't worry. I will go talk to her. I will talk to her. I am always happy to save a youth from destruction. I will talk to her. boy. Make the world a better place. Bravo! Bravo to him. Making the world a better place. You say you paid for your car with money. Yes. Whose money? My money. I have a job, I go to work, my boss pays me money, and then I buy the things that I need. Then how in the world can we know that you are a responsible consumer who pays his or her debts back? I'm sorry, but we need a credit history. Because I have things, and I didn't steal them? I saved for them like a responsible consumer. Well, that doesn't sound very responsible to me, because now I have to reject your application for lack of credit history, okay? So let me get this straight. Because I saved my money and waited till I already had enough money to buy things I needed, I'm an irresponsible consumer. I'm afraid so, sir. And by the way, who taught you that it's a good idea to only spend the money that you already have? Work money stuff. In that order. Don't forget. Fiscal common sense? I don't follow. It really can happen. It does happen. Now, I hate credit a lot. Mostly because I am not very good at making money, now or in the future. I'm a writer. You know, Greece's economy just collapsed horribly, way worse than ours. Because in 2004, when they finally got to start using the euro, they were able to offer really, really low introductory interest rates on loans and credit cards. So everybody got a ton of stuff. And now Greece has to rent out the Colosseum for birthday parties. So all I'm saying is don't be like Greece. There's definitely a place in the world for loans and credit cards. It's important to have emergency funds or credit available, whichever works for you. But just don't go crazy, because not everything that we spend credit money on, or loan money on, is worth the risk. So unless you have as much time to devote to watching your back as they do to screwing you, you're better off playing it safe. That's all I'm saying. Also, if you're like me and you just hate credit altogether, you don't have to do it. That's what my employees do. Make the world a better place to live. Good morning, or day, make the world a better place. At my job.